you want to run a signature for a certain amount of time, such as a signature with a promotional banner, you can do so using the time and date range. So in my case, I have this May promotion showing this banner, and I need to display that during a certain time period in May. Now I could have just switched it on, switched it off manually, but I can do one better. And here I can apply a time and date range. And so I'm going to say that starting from the first Monday in May and starting at a specific time of day, it's going to start at 9 a.m., start of the working day that day. And it's going to run until uh, it's the last Friday in May. And actually, it's going to stop at the very end of that working day, if I can just find 5.30. All right. So basically, this signature is going to be shown automatically between those two dates and those times specifically. But I need to put this first in the priority list before the others. So this one takes priority over the other two. So that effectively, that signature is going to be processed first and it will ignore the others. And then outside of that time, well, it's not going to use that signature. It'll have expired. It's going to go back to using the standard one.